St. Albert's McKenna Shepard, Missy Evazek, big for the Saints as they move on. Ladies, you guys extend your season with a win. Uh, your thoughts? Um, I think tonight our offense, like we weren't hot with the shots, and I think our defense definitely um, pulled us for a win tonight. Yeah, our defense definitely carried us tonight. We didn't have amazing offense, but we'll probably pull it through. You guys, kind of a, a defensive battle in the first half, second half, both teams kind of flipped the switch offensively. What was it? Um, I think if we uh, kept our composure through defense, and then the shots will come on the offense. Yeah, defense is probably our most struggle right now. But if we can pull that through, then that will definitely help our offense. Missy, I think you scored the first five of the, of the night. Uh, were you feeling it early? Oh, no. It's all my teammates. All they, their passes, that's the only reason I score. So it's all them. What's the season been like for you? It's kind of been a little bit of a breakout year, maybe even more so with some of the injuries you guys have had to deal with lately. Yeah, it's definitely difficult with all the injuries and everything going on. But I feel like if we pull together as a team and if we play like we have been playing, then we can definitely make it far in the tournament. They're a tough team to guard. McKenna, you were, you were able to kind of contain them at times tonight. What were you doing so well defensively? Um, I think if we just, again, kept our co composure on defense, then, you know, it'll be easier for us to win. You came up to the free throw line, had a chance to put the game away. Uh, you know, it probably hasn't been your strong suit this year, but you are able to knock them down. Just what was kind of the mentality as you went to the stripe? Um, you know, those are big <laughs> free throws there at the end. So, again, just had to take my time, and it was just me in the basket. You guys had played them once earlier this year. Uh, what was it you guys took away from that that you were able to, to help turn into the victory tonight? Um, you know, with playing them once and then beating us at our place, you know, we were very motivated to come and beat them at their home place. Yeah, definitely. We figured out what people we really need to guard and take care of. And once we do that and focus on that, then we can really pull through. I think it's going to be Fremont Mills coming up Tuesday night. Don't know yet. I know they were up on Grizzled, but what's it going to take to continue your guys' season? Um, if we continue to play strong defense, and I think the shots will come. Definitely. If we just focus on the shots, focus on our free throws, definitely keep going through on our defense, then we can definitely get through. All right, Coach. Uh, survive in advance. The name of the game. You guys able to do that tonight. Just your thoughts? Well, we knew it was going to be a tough ball game down here, Trevor. They're, I, you know, I'm really impressed with their their play, their guard play. They're well coached, uh, young, a young team, and they do some really nice things. But I was really happy with the way that we held our composure in the second half. You know, they made their run at us and took the lead there, and Kenna just really came up with some clutch, uh, clutch play down down the stretch. Kind of a defensive battle in the, the first half, and then there was a stretch there, late third, early fourth, where it didn't seem like either team could miss. What was it that flipped? I think we both just got in the flow a little bit, you know. So, uh, you know, I think both teams realize it's play or you're done, you know. So uh, we, we executed a little bit better and hit some shots there. And, and uh, you know, just like you said, it's all about advancing right now. I know you guys had been without Allie the last couple of games. She had been battling through some injuries, but able to play tonight. How big is it just to have her presence out there? Well, that's huge for us. You know, we, we really weren't sure, you know, even today, uh, I wanted to see during warm-ups how she was feeling with that foot. And, you know, it's more than just her ankle. It's in her foot a little bit. And, uh, you know, so it was kind of a game time decision with her. And I asked her after warm ups, you know, how it felt. She said she thought she could go some. And, and literally tonight was the first time she's played any since she heard it in that Atlantic game. So we needed her, though. I mean, uh, I, I think uh, she's really important to this team, obviously. What can you say about Missy's night? Uh, didn't play like a freshman. No, she sure didn't. And, and uh, you know, she came out and, and uh, I think maybe had our first five points. And our girls have been doing a great job looking for her in practice. You know, she possesses some, some great size, and, and we got to use that to our advantage. I think Fremont Mills was up 10 last I saw. So assuming they're the opponent Tuesday night, what's it going to take? Going to have to play consistent. You know, sometimes we're kind of uh, Dr. Jekyll, Mr. Hyde. And uh, you can't do that this time of year. You got to be consistent all the way through the ball game.